I always get a little nervous if I'm about to meet somebody or hang out with somebody for the first time that I admire because as it goes, it can ruin it for you. You know, it's like if, if you know, the guy turns out to be, a, you know, not a oh. nice person, all of a sudden you can't listen to those songs in the same way. It gets weird. So, yeah. Right, no, I yeah, I think we've all had that. You know, you meet that one person, you have such expectations, you meet them, and you're like, oh, he's a giant douchebag. Damn it. <laughs> Darn it. Well, I guess I'm burning the record collection. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, it, it, it is what it is. What... So, has there been anybody that you've played with or shared this stage with that you said, I really can't believe that this is happening? I really can't believe that. Oh, absolutely. And usually it comes from just like those guys that you never think sure. you're ever going to, like, uh, we, we ended up, we got to open up for Ronnie James Dio, and that was a huge one. And just the fact that he was such an amazing person, too, and, and didn't, here's, here's the thing, too, Chris, what is, I've, I've toured with bands that have been a band for like maybe three years, right. and and this, and I will not absolutely name names, but i got to tell you this story, it really, it's so upsets me, so... We were playing, this was back in the day, playing with this band, and we had this kind of uh, dual meet-and-greet thing after the show. And, uh, and so there was, like, our fans and their fans could all just kind of come out and hang out and get in line and sign whatever. And, uh, and we both had, like, kind of separate wristbands, and people were, like, having to sign them, basically. So uh, this little girl, she's, like, 11 years old, comes up, and, and, uh, and she reached after her wristband, and she has, like, one of the other band's wristbands. She's like, can you sign this? I'm like, absolutely, I'll sign anything. And um, so I signed her, and she goes over to the lead singer of, of the band that we were playing with, and he looks at the wristband, and he says, well, who is that? Who signed that? And she points at me, and he just said, traitor, get out, get out of line. And she, like, looks at him like he's joking. She's 11. And then turns and goes crying to her mother. Like, we ended up giving her a bunch of, like, pics and stuff to try right. to, like, not associate ourselves with. Like, here's a band who had only been a band for maybe about three years or something and already, like, have a chip on their shoulder. And then there's somebody like Ronnie James Dio, who's been in the business for, what, 40 years? Oh, yeah. Something like that. And yeah. goes out, signs everything for anybody, all-inclusive, everybody's welcome, if, and takes every picture and still come back to say goodbye to the opening band. I mean, come on. So to me, there's like no excuse. 